Most people see presidents as the end goal. Trump is like, now that I'm president, I can finally be a successful businessman. <laughs> what are you doing? Focus. President-elect Trump can expect a full barrage from The Daily Show's Trevor Noah in the next four years, as has been the case throughout the campaign. Now, Trevor's background brings a unique perspective to the show Jon Stewart put on the political map. Born at a time when apartheid was still the law of the land in South Africa, Trevor writes all about it in his new book, Born a Crime. Before leaving for Paris, Scott spoke to Trevor in New York. You grew up in a world where you feel like nothing belongs to you, you don't belong anywhere, and so my mom wanted a teammate and she always says and then she gave birth to the selfish little thing that doesn't even love you back sometimes right. and she just she couldn't believe it but the great thing was because she wanted me so much I was chosen you know and that's what I write about in the book and being chosen in my opinion is one of the greatest gifts you can give to another human being Born at a time when apartheid was still the law of the land in South Africa, Trevor did not and could not live with both parents because interracial marriage was illegal. He was raised by his mom. His dad later returned to his native Switzerland. You lived through some pretty difficult things. Was it hard for you to share those things, those aspects of your life in this book? Yes, it was hard, but I feel like it was necessary. If I don't share these stories, who does? You know, if I keep the facade up that I lived a perfect life, then who talks about it somewhere else? So I would rather lay myself bare. I would rather put the stories in a book and then judge me if you want to judge me. And, uh, but the one thing I know is, you know, I share and I'll connect with the people who have that experience and maybe we can move it forward. Trevor shared part of his journey in a talk with fans at Barnes & Noble. Of course, along with the emotion, there were laughs, which brings us Donald Trump, the person who's been the center of attention on The Daily Show for some time now. Well, I think Donald Trump is in a position where, in if anything, we have to hope that he breaks all of his campaign promises. The first time I think people have had that with a politician where they're going, no, 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 don't, don't do what you said. We don't want the promises. You know, the economy, if you want to do that, go ahead. You know, all of that, move forward, but those things you don't need to do. I wonder if it's possible. Will we ever see Donald Trump on The Daily Show? Is that something Anything we is possible. Yeah? Anything is possible.